Wildcats had a great chance in the first, but Reed Meinhardt's shot is turned away. It was 0-0 after one. Second period, Alpina is going to strike first. Cam Young going to fire from the slot. It finds the back of the net, and the Wildcats take a 1-0 lead. Later in the period, Alpina, the top line, is going to get on the board. Shot by Ann and Marceau gets redirected to Meinhardt, who puts it home. Three goals in two games for Meinhardt, 2-0 Alpina. Third period, the two are going to switch places as Meinhardt finds Marceau. The shot is barely going to get over the line with Alpina with a 3-0 lead in the third period. Last minute of the game, and Alpina puts the finishing touches on this one. Marceau going to score on the empty net. That puts Alpina up 4-0. He would go on to score another to complete the hat trick. For the second straight day, Alpina comes away with a 5-0 win. Second shutout in less than 24 hours for Aiden Schultz, who saved all 15 shots he faced. He spoke with WVKB about how the team played and a couple superstitions that he is sticking with. Uh, first period we came to the locker room was 0-0, and second period we worked and we kept working. We knew something was coming, and we, we kept pounding these guys and finally buried a couple and kept going from there. Uh, um, water bottle has to be in the right spot on the net. You know, stick tape stays the same. And... Um, there's just a few same socks every game, you know, can't change too many things. 